Hi, my name is Nicole Lang and I'm the iGlide Product Manager here at iGus Incorporated. With me is Matt Mowry, our Dryland Linear Systems Product Manager. Today, we're going to talk to you about our 12 newest products available now. All right, we'll hop right into some brand new Dryland news. First thing I'd like to start with is our brand new WJRM 31 and 41 10 sliding bearing system. This is actually a hybrid system that incorporates a roller carried by ball bearings for very smooth motion that is stabilized by Dryland R liner. So you kind of get the best feeling from a rolling and sliding system. The sliding parts take any side loads and the rolling part makes it very easy and low friction to move. Incorporate that into a laterally mounted rail system which has these slot nuts for mounting on the back which won't show any hardware in the front in case you're mounting it for monitors or television slides or cabinet slides where you don't want to see any of the hardware. Another product here is Dryland N40 all polymer carriage. We've had this part available for a long time with a zinc carriage, but this all plastic carriage offers about a 40% weight reduction for applications under 9.5 millimeters. Another new favorite product is our Dryland all plastic NTP telescopic system. Lubrication free, 70% lower weight than steel, and of course, very low cost. From there, we move on to our strain wave gears. Using plastic bearing technology for the gear mechanisms, we offer a very low weight, low cost part that can be used on the fifth axis of a robot for end of arm tooling. We also offer our Dryland W stop motion in an updated carriage design. It's a one piece carriage unit, but inside has a ball plunger and combined with detents on the rail, you can position and lock perhaps tablets, cameras, sensors into place very easily. And last but not least, what we're referring to internally is our Minion. This is an all polymer plastic metric pillow block. Really cool, you were able to assemble and disassemble the liner that's inside without shaft removal. Really low weight, really low cost, and very corrosion resistant, especially if you use stainless steel or hard anodized aluminum shafting. Now all these products run without lubrication. The idea is that we offer you a technical advantage and a cost reduction on your project. And now we'll start talking about the iGlide news. Very similar to Matt's Dryland news, the advantages here are technical advantages that help reduce the cost in your applications. So we'll start with our iGlide plate stock strips. Although we've always had larger plate stocks, we've reduced them by having 160 millimeter width options. They come in length up to one meter and they can be cut to length for you. They're available in 10 different materials with thicknesses in six, 10, 15, 30, and 50 millimeters. Next up is our Q2E bearing. These are multi-component bearings that we've had available since last year's news. They're meant for really extreme loading, such as 26,000 PSI. They're meant to take very high edge loads as well. The Q2E bearing is now available to you in inch sizes, from 3 quarters of an inch to 2 and a quarter. And now from our clip bearings, we have always had clip bearings, but we've extended the offering by including different materials. So now we have our A230 material. This material is ideal for food contact applications. It meets both FDA and EU requirements, and the color makes it optically noticeable. So if it were to get into any food, you'd be able to see it. In addition to that is our K250 clip bearing. The K250 clip bearing meets the needs of customers who are looking for an e-coating process. So very common in automotive applications, the K250 can withstand the e-coating process. Next up and very exciting, we are now also offering injection molded rollers. What makes these unique is that you're able to configure a guide roller directly through our CAD system. So you can configure and design a guide roller and then you can print it or we can injection mold it, whatever works best for you. From our 3D printing side, we also have our i8, which is a ESD material. So any application where electrostatic discharge is to be avoided, this material is perfect for that. From our Aegi Ball line, we offer the same advantages of all of our plastic bearings. So we have corrosion resistant, self-lubricating and maintenance free plastic balls that can be used in any type of metal housing or component. So those are also available from stock, offering the same advantages of iGlide, but for use in combination with metal components. For more information on these products and more, please click the links below. And if you're working on a project now, you have application questions for me or Nicole, please also feel free to reach out to either one of us. Thanks for watching.